You are 2024 national champion. Please tell me how you're feeling. I think I'm just in shock. I just like, the last couple of years I wanted this so bad and every year I finish just a bit disappointed. And I just can't believe that. Yeah, I just wanted it so bad today and I had amazing legs. I mean, it helped that I was always up the road on the climb, but yeah, I couldn't thank my team enough. Like, really, really, like, this is the best group. And um, yeah, I'm just in shock in the last time in Ballarat, like, uh. How did you build this win? over the summer and um, yeah I had amazing legs today I felt really really good it helped that I was over the top of the climb without Sarah Gigante a few times because uh, she is so strong but yeah I just had an amazing day and just kept yeah rolling with the moves and really wanted it but tried to also play it cool a little bit and not overwork it yeah I think in the past I've uh, overworked this race a lot like tried to do too much too early and it's a race that you can't really come in with a really rigid plan, which I kind of like to do in the past. And this year, I really knew I just had to be fluid and, you know, see what happened, just trust my instincts. And so I just kept rolling with it, but like keeping a little bit in reserve and yeah, just had the best legs I've had in a long while on the day. So yeah. When we look at the week, two jerseys for you. Uh, what this one means, what does that mean for you? Oh, this one means so much. Uh, the crit, the crit is great. Like I, it was, a race that I've done a lot and um, I love it but this is another level like bringing it to Europe um, it means so much to the team like with Jaco Lula you know I think Jerry's here today uh, so yeah it's a really really special thing as an Australian team to bring that jersey home and uh, I can tell you before the start I walked out of the coffee shop to get a coffee bumped into your dad he was as cool as a cucumber you know what we didn't even talk about the race we we're talking about life in Brunswick how much we love the suburb so good to have your, your family here as well. Yeah, yeah, my family's here and my dad, especially because he got me into the sport, he actually came third in the 180 uh, teams. Take us through this last sprint. It was a drag race, wasn't it, to the line? Yeah, honestly, I wasn't really thinking. I was just so, I wanted it so bad and like I knew I had the legs. So it was one of those moments where you just in flow, in race mode, what you've done a thousand times before and um, yeah, I, don't, I, I can't even really articulate what happened. Uh, Gr Gracie said in the interview with you that it will take a few days, if not weeks, to, to sink in. What's the program? What, what's for the next week for you? Yeah, next week I have Tua Down Under, so I'm really excited for that. Uh, it's just another special race. And then Cadell's, which is another close to home race coming from Melbourne. So, yeah, I'm really, really excited for those two races and can't wait to wear the jersey.